talk to you guys a little bit about uh, spray chemicals today uh, and the amount of water versus chemicals we put on the field. Uh, mostly uh, for all our applications uh, besides fungicide, we put uh, 10 gallons in the acre on uh, total product in water. Uh, time, uh, it's nine and a half gallons of water per acre and only half a gallon of chemical an acre. Uh, I got a little demonstration here. Uh, we're just using water in both uh, this, for this demonstration. Uh, an acre, uh, to give you guys kind of an idea, is a rough size of a football field uh, with the end zone cut off. It would be uh, a rough size of what an acre is. But I'm going to dump this uh, one out here. This is nine and a half gallons of water. This is what goes over the whole acre here. chemical that goes over a whole acre, only half a gallon, and uh, that includes all our uh, herbicides and uh, surfactants and everything that goes into there, uh, so it's not very much. Uh, if you don't want to over apply, it can cro cause crop injury, and uh, this would cost us more money. We also uh, put fungicides on sugar beets uh, for leaf spot uh, in the summer here. I'm going to start uh, spraying that in a couple weeks here. Or in a week, uh, we're pretty dry. Uh, it needs to be moisture in the air and also moisture in the ground for it to form. So we'll hold off uh, until we get some rain. Hopefully we get some rain. Things are getting pretty dry. Uh, but for that, uh, we use, we've put 15 gallons to the acre on overall. And we're only putting about 13 to 18 ounces of chemical on into that, and the whole rest is water. So now we're even doing less chemical over the nature.